Hi everybody, this is Kathy from Kathy's Cards. Well, I got some happy mail to share with you today. I had bought from Paula Vines. She um, was selling her My Bestie stamps, and I absolutely love them, and I don't have that many. And uh, so I bought them from her, so I have to show you what I got. And she also included a couple extra things. And this is so nice. This is a garden bird, birdhouse die cut. Look at that. Oh, that's going to be nice. Thank you, Paula, so much. They are just so cute. And then we got a bird cage. I'll have fun with that. Now, let me see. I honestly didn't get a chance to go back and look at the video. I just knew she was having them. She was selling them, and I'm like, I want them. <laughs> and I missed out on the first batch. So these last two batches, I was able to get. Got them in this nice tissue paper, which unfortunately I have to rip up. <laughs> All right. These are lots. Lot one. Let me see here. Oh, look at this one. Beach party. Oh, isn't that adorable? <laughs> I love it. This one here is color and create movie night. And she's got popcorn. These are so adorable. I can't wait to stamp these and color these. These are so different from the few that I do have. I love it in the bathtub. Bubble bath. Oh, look at this one. <laughs> Fluffy besties, it looks like. Ah, she might have her paintbrush. I'm not sure. She might be uh, crafting. Looks like there might be paintbrushes in there. So cute. Oh, look at this one. Another bathing suit one. Yellow polka dot bikini. <laughs> oh, that's precious. And we got lot two. Fluffy bestie. Sunbathing beauty. <laughs> I don't ever remember these. Fluffy Franny. Looks like she's having a nice drink. Maybe a Starbucks or something like it. Tiny Teddy Fluffy Bestie. <laughs> oh, look at this one in the Hawaiian. In the Hawaiian dress. Hula Dancy Bestie. Fluffy Besties. So cute. Let's do coffee. Fluffy Besties. <laughs> oh, these are adorable. Oh, my God. I got another set. Into these. Not that one's. Yeah. Yeah. And we got lot three and four. Oh, I'm probably going to mix them up here. Let's see. Oh, look at that. Isn't she adorable? Oh, she's so cute. Oh, that is precious. Oh, there's another one. I just love um, Sherry Baldy. She does. She makes these girls, besides their big eyes, she just is so colorful. And Oh, look at this one. Here's my heart. Oh, that would be a cute one for Valentine. I'll have to use that next year. Oh, look at this. <laughs> that is sweet. <laughs> oh, my. Look at the big glasses. <laughs> and let's see here. <laughs> oh, my God. That is so cute. I'll look at this one. Annabelle. 
Oh, I'm going to have so much fun with these. <laughs> I love the glasses. I remember years ago, in fact, when uh, Michael was born, I was looking back at some of the pictures, and those big glasses were in. Oh, look at this. Oh. And it's so cute. And this one's a little sailor girl. Oh, I love these. Thank you, Paula, so much for selling these. I am so excited, and I cannot wait to start working on these. This is going to be, like, so much fun. <laughs> <coughs> I haven't gotten too many new stamps, so this will get me going again. All right. I'll put that aside. The other thing I wanted to share with you is uh, Crafts by Teresa. I had bought a few things from her auction, and also she was selling some stuff on Facebook. So uh, probably these will be a little mixed. I bought this from her auction. Let me lift my camera up a little here. Isn't this awesome? I just thought this was the greatest. <clears throat> she did some sort of texture background. I don't know how she does it. She comes up with the coolest backgrounds. She's going to have to teach me. And then the colors, a lot of times the colors that she, use, that she uses are just really, this is just, I love it. It's, it's even more spectacular in person, Tina. I mean, Teresa. Paris, look at the, the Paris key. And all the, and this, I love this cutout. This is, um. I think it's cardboard but aren't they, that is cool I have to get one of those so I did buy that from the auction and hang on a second okay now the next thing is I bought these are crocodiles and these are for doing corners and she had two of them one was as you can see this makes kind of like a square at the corners and the other one that I got this is the round one so I was excited to get them because everybody says these are really good then we had these pens I think these were from the auction um, these are Jan Davenport, and these are watercolor pens, mermaid markers. So I'm excited to try these out. Something different. So I figured, you know, I'd check them out and see how they are and if I like them. So I got that. And then I got some um, trim here. I don't use black a lot. When I do, it's nice to have, especially in steampunk in that. I think it was a couple yards, but isn't that beautiful? I just love that. I thought that was so pretty. So I just got a couple yards of that. Put that there. And then she threw in some extras. Look at this cute little clipboard. It's so tiny. I love it. So I will definitely be doing something with that, altering it somehow. <laughs> put it up a little here. And then she put a pad in, things to do, with the little birds. And then this is bags, probably like candy bags, I'm assuming. So that's nice because these are fun. You can emboss them and um, stamp them, whatever. These are great to use and then she sent me along this is another chalkboard one and just like this one here which was steampunk she gave me this one here as an extra special to send along and I love this one too I just love these wooden things they are so cool but look at here look at all the texture that she did all the purple and then uh, the background this is so cool I I don't know if this is where she uses some of her paste but I mean that is so cool I love it 
you know it's not just stencil there's a actual texture there so anyways this is what I got from uh, Teresa from crafts by Teresa and while I'm here I'm also want to thank crafty lady Lisa I got a lovely thank you card from her today for being in her challenge which is such a, she's such a sweetheart to do that it says thanks a bunch and then inside she's got all these cute little ephemera all these sweet little things that you can use I mean that's something she doesn't have to do but she's such a sweetheart for doing it and then inside here she's got thank you Kathy for all your support and thank you for entering my challenge love crafty lady Lisa well thank you Lisa I enjoyed it when I can I love to uh, be in challenges but that was really sweet of you to send a thank you card not necessary but very thoughtful and I don't want to forget uh, uh, Lisa for that so anyways I just wanted to share with you my happy mail and I hope everybody is having a good day and I'm sure I'll be talking to you again real soon bye